welcome uh, in this video we will explain how to compile a program in online so open chrome and type online c compiler then different things will be uh, will be shown select any one i am selecting total point compiler so the net is little bit slow um, so it is opening yes uh, in the left side it shows the basic code and we need to here also is good automatically the output is coming and one thing you need to know if anything is changed automatically it will be reflected okay the output will be reflected so here what i am doing is uh, one more important thing uh, no need to write conio.h why because online platforms does not support clr scr and get ch functions and that is the reason do not write hash, uh, hash include conio.h and do not use uh, clr scr or get ch why because it is the waste of your time so here you can write anything automatically it will work so already int main is there so int a comma b i am writing the swapping of two numbers uh, without using third variable printf and uh, so, so sorry int a is equal to 10 and b is equal to 20 printf before swapping And the mechanism I am writing so here again we need to type the output so now we need to execute this program automatically the output will be coming but they are in sequential if you want to break a line so we need to use slash n for this automatically the output so keep in mind that whenever we are doing it compulsory we need to execute our run button definitely you have to use that button and type the program do not try to print off enter the number input will not give directly so already they are providing some test cases 
so automatically internally it can run if they are providing separate input box definitely it helps you to solve it okay uh, i am also writing one more program for you uh, same program will be written in a different manner uh, so when i am in multiplication and division procedure the output is same no change very nice and uh, i'm also trying to write uh, using bitwise xr the output will not reflect means i am explaining three logics what i mentioned in the videos thank you